Uh, I'm glad to see part of this big crowd here at Harrison County Democrats. Uh, 200 this year is a demonstration to me that things are going well with the Democratic Party here in Harrison County. And I am impressed. Republicans uh, are very good at counting their chickens before they're hatched. And let me tell you something, ladies and gentlemen, they are counting their chickens before they're hatched. They think they've got this election wrapped up already here in April, and we've got six months to go. Not only at the federal level, the state level, but the local level. They think the Democrats are on the run. Well, let me tell you something. I'm here to tell you the Democrats are not on the run. We hold these offices, and we're getting the job done for a change. We're the I hear over and over again from some Republicans <laughs> is the fact that, well, at least you Democrats are doing something for a change. And we are. I remember in 2008, it was about this time, it was before the Indiana primary, we didn't know who our nominee was going to be for president. We didn't know what was going to happen to the House and Senate seats. And I was speaking to the young men and women over in Hanover, and one of them asked me a question after I made my remarks. They asked me if, they thought, if I thought that a Democrat was going to win the presidency, and that the Democrats were going to increase their majorities in the House and Senate. And I said, yes, I believe that we are. I believe we're going to have a Democratic president for the first time in eight years, and I believe we're going to increase our majorities. But we're going to have a price to pay. Because the difficulties that we are facing in this country under the leadership of George Bush and the Republican Congress are so immense and so great that we are going to have to make the tough decisions.